So uh, last week I made a video featuring my fish eating a fruit, which is a pear. And uh, today I want to develop a little bit more on why I fed a fruit to my fish and why I still am right now. Uh, the reason is quite simple. Um, a lot of your tropical fish, if not all of them, since the word is tropical, come from tropical environments. And it's very natural that seasonally fruits fall into the water. And what happens when the fruits fall in the water? Well, clearly the fish start eating them. Uh, fruits are a natural part of most fish diet, uh, especially the vegetarian and the omnivorous. Omnivorous means basically you can eat anything vegetable or protein uh, or like animal protein. So um, my fish currently, the ones you're looking at, are from the genome Vieja and they are very oriented towards being mostly vegetarian. Now. I could feed them some uh, leafy vegetables or things like that, such as like zucchini, spinach, but I prefer giving them fruit because seasonally in their natural environment, fruit fall down and fruit uh, have a higher concentration in vitamin C. Vitamin C is absolutely essential for uh, your fish. It really boosts their immune system, it keeps them strong, it keeps them healthy and they really need it in their diet. So I really suggest you give them uh, some food that has and contains vitamin C. Uh, you can find it in uh, good quality pellets, an additive of vitamins. You can uh, add um, vitamins to your dry food um, from a um, bottle called Vita Cham or any other um, liquid vitamins. You can soak up some pellets, in it, but I suggest the natural way, just giving them pieces of fruit. Uh, clearly, now you see it's getting a little bit messy uh, in the water, but if you have a good filter, it will pick it all up. And um, vegetable matter is not as uh, polluting in the water as would be uh, if you threw shrimp or like raw fish in there so don't worry about your water quality so much just uh, make sure you have a strong filter or while they're eating it just turn off your filters how about that <laughs> let them just finish their uh, food in peace just keep your air pumps going as i have here so yes they really really need food in their diet and what i also like to do is i prepare my own uh, homemade food i'll put a link below uh, you add fruits into it uh, if you have fish that come from these environments and that's in their natural diet to eat fruits um, blend it up with some like shrimp with some raw fish and freeze it and then you can give them daily because there's nothing wrong about giving uh, more vitamin C the excess is always um, expelled in urea in people so what types of fruit can you feed to your fish uh, actually, I'll, uh, I'll mention fruits and vegetables so you know what you can feed to your fish. Uh, in the vegetables, you can feed them de-shelled peas, that means regular peas that you remove the shell of. Uh, you can feed them blanched zucchini. Um, many people like to feed uh, blanched spinach, but the thing is when um, you feed spinach, I will correct it if I'm wrong in the description. But I do believe it lowers the overall um, iron content uh, when they absorb the food. Wait, is it the iron or is it uh, the digestion of protein? I'll have to verify and re-mention it underneath. Uh, but yeah, this is like one of the reasons why I avoid spinach. It's the same for um, like tortoises, they say don't feed spinach because it denaturalizes the protein or something along those lines. Um, so you de-peel all of your uh, vegetables such as like the zucchini or the cucumber uh, just because they, it, it's hard for them to uh, firstly um, graze at it but they can still get through it but mostly uh, because um, these vegetables 
are usually sprayed with pesticides and things like that things you don't see to the naked eye but are not removable so much by just washing so um, if you want to make sure that you don't enter any pesticides in your fish food just uh, remove the peels of the things you feed them now as for uh, fruits uh, you, you can feed them um, apples you can feed them pears I heard some people even feeding bananas one of the most successful fruits I've fed uh, was actually jackfruit, believe it or not. They enjoy jackfruit and any fish such as an uaro that has good teeth, uh, they can go through jackfruit really easily. So here we have a pear that they're totally devouring. Uh, this is going to be gone in about an hour. So, And don't forget to uh, hit the like button, subscribe if you want to see more of me and hit the bell button to get my notifications in case you don't see my videos when I post them. Alright, thank you guys. See ya.